One of the things that I do love to do is to get an hour by myself and drive my car. It relaxes me and it helps me get things in perspective, realise that I'm lucky. That particular car I bought, you know, over 10 years ago, I've made a few modifications, nothing that can't be reversed. All the original body parts hang on the wall there in the garage. One of my favourite memories from the car was going with my dad down to France to watch some racing at Classic Le Mans. That was really special and something I'll always remember. Pinnacle 911 was, you know, mid 70s, so uh, that was the look I was going for. Sometimes if I need a bit of headspace, I like to get in and drive. I ended up getting in the car at three o'clock in the morning. All the, the worry that was in my brain, I was able to kind of focus that out. I called my wife, told her I was in Scotland. She thought I was joking. 911s are not particularly masculine, but they're not particularly feminine. They're just a nice piece of design, which I think suits everyone. Certainly the older cars, I think people appreciate them and it's been a kind of a, a slow labour of love really to get it how it is now so I've learned with classic cars that you know it's very much a process your wallet dictates how quick you can go so I've had to be very patient uh, with other priorities regardless of what type of car or what make or what particular model I think if you think it's cool it's cool I don't think there's a recipe, I just think it's a, it's a feeling. Once you find it, you've got to, got to keep it. <laughs>